What is up, Fitty Gang, and welcome back. Now, I know I said I wasn't gonna do another walleye cheater video. I wasn't going to, I wasn't planning on it, but people have been sending me all kind of clips and stuff telling me that I need to, to talk about it and put it on the channel. Do me a favor, guys, if you haven't already, please smash the subscribe button, turn the notifications on. I drop fresh, entertaining content every single week. I actually just went fishing today. That's why I'm kind of dressed like a bum. I was just out fishing. But yeah, guys, I appreciate you guys tuning in and dropping a sub. There's two new clips that are absolutely unreal. The one is clearly Jake Runyon. Uh, two, like, I think it was two days before the tournament talking about like how they were going to win. So I'm just being super cocky, talking about like how like winners. He said at one point, he said winners win. He said he knew he was going to do well. He said he was super confident for the tournament. And I mean, obviously, because he was planning on cheating. So it's, it's just crazy how like, you know, in my opinion, cocky and arrogant that he comes off, especially when like he knows like deep down that he's a cheater. Like he might portray himself as this winner, quote unquote, but clearly, you know, he's just a cheater. And then the other clip is some audio footage, allegedly, I'm saying allegedly, because I don't know for sure, but allegedly, it sounds like it, allegedly of uh, Chase Kaminsky talking about his wife and another woman in a very kind of derogatory kind of way just just like a real sleazy type of way just kind of like shows the kind of character of these guys you know obviously people who are really going to cheat like that for as long as they did are not going to be very good stand-up guys but we're going to go ahead and play the uh, jake runyon clip first so stay tuned and uh just let me comment below let me know what you guys think about this pretty wild in second place for the fab five so the loot has a fab five thing you take your five best fish and they take that total weight and you get a payout for that too so we're sitting in second place for that and first place for team of the year they take your four best tournaments plus your championship points and that's what determines team of the year we won rossford which was not a loot tournament that we won that and we've won three loot tournaments in a row lorraine ashtabula and geneva so we won the championship last year. Now granted, this championship is a different time of year this year than it was last year, but I don't want to sound arrogant or cocky, but I am confident that we should do well in this championship also because it's just what we do. Winners win. Uh, I feel the pressure for team of the year, I'd say. I know Chase does too. Um, I wouldn't necessarily feel the pressure of winning the tournament. I wouldn't be totally upset that somebody else wins for a champ or cha a change, but uh, I expect to win. So yeah, guys, that's the clip from Jake Runyon. Uh, I mean, it was like I think it was two days. They were actually out pre-fishing. Not sure who took the actual footage. Yeah, that's that's uh, that's pretty pretty wild. Being that cocky, that arrogant, that fool of himself, knowing that knowing that he's cheating, like he knows that he's a cheater, and you're gonna talk like that. I don't I don't know how you can. How do you look yourself in the mirror like, I, I don't understand it. All right guys, so now we're gonna play the audio file from uh, Chase Kaminsky, allegedly, from allegedly Chase Kaminsky, uh, discussing basically him cheating on his wife and just just being just being a real big scumbag, really. We're gonna go ahead and play that. Shout out to Slab Stalker on TikTok for posting this video and this audio clip. But yeah guys, we're gonna go ahead and, go ahead and play that now. Talking some fish to eat or something. Fuck that. All right. Well, I threw three fish up in this fucking front line while they just suck my dick. Yeah. Yeah, I don't blame you there. That fucking. I seen a lot of people that did. Yeah. Well, I mean, you're out there fishing. Why the fuck wouldn't you? Right. This chick that I brought up here to the hotel never had a wall. I'm trying to cook her some. Give her the old walleye. Give her some fucking. Yeah, walleye. fucking something. Give that bitch a walleye. Uh huh. Get some, get some stank. Fuck it, man. Wife wants to play games. Hey. Yeah. I'm gonna get some fucking pussy. Fuck yeah. 100%. Fuck it. How's this place to stay at? It's just, just like disgusting. Just disgusting. This is gonna be the last video I do on this. I had a bunch of direct messages and stuff. People asked me to do one more. So this is gonna be the last one, guys. I'm, I kind of just wanna just sit back now and just kind of watch this unfold. I don't wanna do any more like reaction videos or anything on it. Just not a good thing it's just not i don't know man this you know it's not good for the fishing community definitely not good for the walleye scene hate to see this stuff but yeah guys comment below let me know your thoughts on this i had a lot of people asking about the fish tank so i'm gonna show those real quick so you actually call this the fish room got a tank full of sticklets right now which they like to hide when i'm in here i got you can't really see but i got uh blood parrots 
There's convict cichlids. The Jack Dempsey or something. There's actually a little channel cap fishing too that's been hiding for a while. Just seen the Jack Dempsey put his head in one. Pretty cool fish right there. Yeah, and then over here, I got my Mershear and my pet bass. I don't have a name for him yet, so if you guys want, comment below. Try and come up a name with the for the bass. I actually don't have a name for the Bershear either yet. He's hiding in the driftwood. I uh, got some food in there for him, you know. Yeah, guys, if you want to name the bass, comment below. But yeah, guys, I appreciate you guys tuning in and uh, watching these videos over the last couple days. Like I said, it's gonna be the last one I do on the walleye cheaters, guys. It's gonna be the last walleye cheater scandal video on this channel. Appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please smash the subscribe button, hit the like button. I'll see you next time. We got weights and fish. There we go. Oh, Everybody listen to me right now. Jake, I want you to leave. I don't want anybody to touch these guys. I want you to leave. He's going to jail. Jason, you should come to the It's It's bad. You fucking hit the bullshit. You fucking done this, motherfucker. You fucking bullshit. Don't we need to file a police report? Yeah. Jason, we got to file a police report. All of them. All of them. Every fucking one. Every single fucking thing. Say it. Every single one. Every single one. Every single one. fucking champ, dude. I mean, we all fucking knew it. What the fuck, man? Fuck yeah. They've been doing this whole fucking time. All of them. You got them. You got them. You got them. You got them. A filleted fish. Look at this. Is a filleted, yeah. A filleted fish. It's a walleye filleted. He needs to go to jail. Yeah, he needs to say, Jerry. You call the cops. I got video. You got anything to say? You guys do what you want. We fuck all that fucking money. You fucking talk shit to me, dude. That's what you fucking do. How many fucking ways are in there? You fucking scum. You fucking piece of shit. Here we go, Steve. Take pictures. I need pictures. Are you this whole thing? Got video. Yeah. I videoed it right off the rip. Hold on, let me take pictures. You fucked over a lot of people, man. They've been doing this shit for years. Cheating motherfuckers, man. He's the fucking shit. You got a fucking boat, you got thousands of fucking dollars. You stole from everyone.